hi ladies and gentlemen in this tutorial we're going to learn skin retouching we're going to make the face very smooth you can see the face is very rough with some pimples on it we're going to remove it and make this smooth very very smooth so we start by duplicating the picture by hitting on Control plus G on the keyboard you can give it any name now we create a layer black and white layer let's increase the black the red and also lower the yellow close it we create another curves layer let's increase the brightness now click on the duplicate picture and uh, add a layer now let's uh, go to our tool and choose our spot healing brush tool increase you can reduce the size make sure the hardness is 100% and the spacing is 25% click on the spots with your mouse and let's remove all the black spots on the face we are removing the black spots on the face remember you can we can't remove all so definitely we're going to leave some on the face it doesn't mean we can't still smooth in the face so we'll, we'll still have to leave some there only that we have to do our best so i think this is okay so now let's highlight the black and white layer and the curves by holding on control and select it to right click and delete the layers now hold on shift Control plus Alt and E to duplicate the layer and name it Skin. Now let's change the blending mode to Vivid Light. Vivid Light and hit on Control plus I to invert. Right click and convert it to Smart Object move to filter order and choose high pass here we can let's choose high pass of 20 hmm. or let's choose 25 let's choose 25 so 25 is okay now we are not done go to filter blur gaussian blur and choose a radius make sure you give it a low radius uh, if you give it much radius the picture will not look nice so we give it two well, let's give it uh, 1.5 or oh, 1.3 is okay Let's give it two. Two, two. Now create a max on the skin layer and hit on control plus I to invert. Get your brush tool and uh, make sure you set the flow to 15. The opacity should be 100. Now make sure your hardness is zero can choose any size that is okay for you so i'll choose a higher size hold on the mouse but make sure you are on the invert max here hold it and paint on it that one paint on it paint on the picture
thing turn the picture to remove oh the pimples on the face removed all the blemishes on the face you can see the face is smooth now let's hold on shift control alt and e at the same time and name it final convert it right click and convert to smart object now select your filter and come to camera roll in our camera roll let's go to basics and uh bring up the contrast a little reduce the black just that uh, to be somewhere yeah let's um the clarity let's bring up the clarity and also uh, let's go to details the sharpness let's bring it up little reduce the Noise. Let's go. Five is okay. Five is okay. Now let's go to the effect. Upgrade the grain small. Yeah, hit okay. So you can see. Now let's hold on control. And select all the layers and match them so this was then now then you can see now then now then thanks for watching please remember to subscribe to the channel to motivate me to bring you more of these videos Thank you for watching.